Now, the good thing about fractions is there's more than one way to express them, the same quantity using different fractions. We call these equivalent fractions. So we can show 2 sixths can be reduced to 1 third. It's the same amount, but a fewer number of pieces. Okay. Now, there are times when you also need to use a greater number of pieces to show the same amount, and we call that raising a fraction, and in this case, we would use three pieces from the family of nine to show the same value as two sixths. Let me lay these out in a better way. Okay. All of these fractions rep represent the same amount. So now you've learned a little bit about equivalent fractions today. Thanks.